I'm Pat Gunn and we're playing Skyrim. So here we are in the house of um, what's his name? In the house of uh, Mercer and we are looking for some kind of evidence. So where'd you come from? Oh. So it looks like we're not gonna be able to Actually, at this point, I'm just gonna transform and take these guys out. Ow, they have nice weapons. Ow. Yeah, they have really nice weaponry. Let's just toss this guy because I don't want to be a. Okay. So if I'm going to be doing this, I might as well do it whole hog, but I'm not sure if there are any foes left around. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna keep on keep on moving. Now, one of the downsides of being a vampire lord is that you can't see your uh, you can't bring up the uh, the mini map. Oh, well, this is nice. I guess I'm going to take Poison Talons just so that I can get Nightcloak next, but I'm going to have to revert form. Now, yeah, so let's do that. And where am I going? Okay, I guess I'm going up or downstairs and roughly straight a little bit to the left. Somehow. So oh, let's get some light in here. Is there anything that way? Well, if there is, it's probably not down here. On the other hand, there's a little bit of garlic, which as a vampire, I probably shouldn't get too attached to. Come on, move. And yeah, there's some bandits down here. But I can't lift the... Uh, Door bars here. Aha. Magic potion, and um, I guess this is where we want to go. So, it's a trap, but it's not actually that bad because. Well, it's probably bad for Serana. Fortunately, she can't be killed. Ow! Okay, that is not cool. sure what this trap does, but probably had enough of traps for just now, so I prefer to... Chilrend's display case. So I think Chilrend is one of the unique weapons in the game. As you play through, you will notice um, there are a fair number of, of uh, weapons that are unique. Many of them if you do use enchanted weapons, uh, one of the uh, pains in the butt is that you need to keep them charged by filling them with more soul gems. A lot of the unique weapons don't need to be uh, refilled. Some of them do. I never... I 
I'm not sure which which weapons are like that and which aren't. Okay, there are Mercer's plans and Yep, so that is what I need to do here. And let's see if there's another way out down here. There might be. Yes, Ratway Vault. That looks good. Hopefully it'll be a quick uh, hop back to the Thieves Guild. Yeah, this is just a drop down. And um, I'm not entirely certain where I am. But is this? Yeah, ragged flagon. Cool. I guess that might have been the area where I uh, got Esprin. Read your fate. Let me guess. He just plucked you off the line to my face. On the other hand, taking some of these extra jobs off. See? That kind of... So, if you've got the nerve, look around. A few decades ago. Look, I know the other... Something out there is piss drunk. I'll tell you what we do. We spit. That's where you come in. All you need to do is ask, and we could both come out of this smelling like a... Well, well, if you happen to cry, it's worth quite a bit, actually. Quite a catch. Well, well. Okay, so if this actually is the guy who who buys the random they should come. Well, uh, well. stuff if that you can come, find in the game. Well, you find so cool. To be bored and fair. And, uh... This could get... Dangerous. Don't let anything get a jump on you. Let's see, what did I... Okay, Brynjolf is... Ahead, maybe? Yeah, I guess he's ahead. So... The top Shore's beard. He's going after if he gets his hands on them. You can be certain. Agreed. He's taken ev I've spoken to Carlia and made amends for how the guild. Quickly. We have no time to lose. No time to lose. Okay, so what we do here. Okay, Carlia should be off to the left. She no is over you. here. I promise you. All your questions will be answered. You just have so, it isn't clear in the game how your followers deal with you being Not now, last. Said it was important. Uh, being in the guild like this. Like, is she an honorary member too? Uh, hey, good to see you. I promised. Bring your on. The time has come to decide Mercer's fate. Until a new guildmaster is chosen, the decision falls to you. I last. And I've come to a decision. Mercer Frey tried to kill both of you. He betrayed the guild, murdered Gallus, and made us question our future. He needs to die. We have to be very careful, Brynjolf. Mercer is a nightingale, an agent of Nocturnal. Okay. It's all true. Everything I heard in the stories. The Why are they... Their allegiance to Nocturnal. Are they not going to look at, at each other at all? That's why we need to prepare ourselves and meet Mercer on equal footing. Just outside of Riften, beyond the southeast gate is a small path cut up the mountainside. At the end of that path is a clear and an old standing stone. I'd ask you both to meet me there. Okay. So, that is where we're going. this cloak is made of. Of course with games like this it's hard to tell whether unusual textures are the result of uh, something intentional or 
uh, order just a result of inadequate technology. Like this looks a lot like um, there was something called fruit roll-ups when I was a kid. And they were actually kind of disgusting. Um, well, plast uh, like a plasticky, like an edible plastic that looked a lot like this that had a strong fruit flavor. I have no idea what they were made of. But, yeah, a, a, an entire cloak made out of fruit roll-ups is kind of weird and yeah, nasty. Okay, so we are headed outside, and I think this is the nearest uh, quick travel marker. curious about that uh, thing halfway down the handle. Is that mainly for decoration or for added grip or is the uh, is the head of the or not the head of the hammer the stick part of the hammer is it actually in two parts? Anyhow where we're headed is a little bit east. Oh is that a dragon somewhere? It might be a dragon somewhere. Chickens! Hey chickens! So east is this way. Looks like there are. Oh. Someone do something. Wait, what's going on? I don't see where our foe is. Oh, it is a dragon. Okay, so we're gonna get a flame after knock and see if we can interest it in a fight. It looks like this is kind of the way that we would use to get east anyhow. So it looks like maybe it fl uh, flew off. Oh well. So, Serana, are you going to be a Nightingale, too? I suppose uh, it doesn't really matter. Since Serana and I are vampires, and I'm the head of the Majors College, and, and so on, so... Okay. So this is Nightingale Hall. I heard about this place when I joined the guild. Wait, who's, but I never believed it. Did I summon this? Yeah, I did. The assumption that the nations were just a myth proceeded within the guild on purpose. It could help divert attention from our true nature. What's wrong with me? You must hear you. I'm trying to understand my view. Are you seeing this? It's fantastic. It's, uh, it's cool. It's not fantastic. hear something. Didn't seem to actually do anything. Well, it makes a noise. It's kind of an irritating, uh... Are we missing someone? Oh, it's, where is she? Okay. Okay, this gave me Nightingale armor. 
So I'll put this stuff on. Okay. Now, where is Carlia? This isn't Carlia. I think we should trust the lass and take the deal. Well, where is the lass? Oh, she's still taking her time getting here. I imagine dressing up the flame atronach would be silly. And Serana is not particularly interested in becoming a nightingale, so let's keep moving. Looks like Brynjolf is actually leading the way. Okay, lass. We've got these get-ups on. Now what? Whoa there, lass. I appreciate the armor, but becoming a nightingale? That was never discussed. Hold any of it, defeating Mercer. We must have Nocturnal at our backs. She's to accept you as one of her own. An arrangement must be struck. Okay, okay. What sort of arrangement? I need to know the terms. The terms are quite simple, Brynjolf. Nocturnal will allow you to become a nightingale and use your... And in return, both in life and in death, you must serve as a guardian of the Twilight Sepulchre. Aye, there's always a catch. But at this point... I suppose there isn't much to lose. If it means the end of Mercer Frey, you can count me in. What about you? Are you ready to transact the oath with Nocturnal? Good. After I open the gate, trust the lass and take the deal. Western Circle? Western Circle? Oh, I guess that's somewhere up ahead. No, I'm not allowed to pull the chain. I think we should trust the lass and Yes. You're getting we'll kind of excessively uh, talkative about that. So I'm surprised that they allow Serana uh, to just come along Speak here. Okay, so I am to stand on this. And I guess I'll stand with Serana. Mm. Come on, guys. Let's get this over with. I call upon you, Lady Nocturnal, Queen of Merc, and Empress of Shadow. Hear my voice. Ah, Carlia. I was wondering when I'd hear from you again. Lose something, did we? My lady, I've come before you to throw myself upon your mercy and to accept responsibility for my failure. You're already mine, Carlia. Your terms were struck long ago. What could you possibly offer me now? I have two others that wish to transact the earth. To serve you both in life and in death. So I guess Serana actually has already pledged uh, herself to. I can't remember his name, Malig Ball. My appetite for mercy's demise. And that's why she's uh, a vampire lord. Revenge. How interesting. Very well. The conditions are acceptable. You may proceed. dedicate ourselves to you as both your Avengers and your Sentinels. We will honor our agreement in this life and the next until your conditions have been met. Very well. I name your initiates Nightingale, and I restore your status to the same, Carlisle. And in the future, I'd suggest you refrain from disappointing me again. So some of the data are do take human forms, some don't, more or less. So, I think that uh, Nocturnal can take human form. Now that you've transacted the oath, it's time to reveal the final piece of the puzzle to you. Mercer's true crime. Jaywalking! Mercer was able to unlock the guild's vault without two keys because of what he... By doing this, he's compromised our ties to Nocturnal. Well, yes. All of us possess them. Once you realize the key can access these traits, 
potential becomes limitless. Although it would benefit the guild if the key isn't returned. As time passed, our luck would diminish to the point of non-existence. Very true. You know, before we depart, Brynjolf has some business to discuss. I suggest you listen. I suggest you talk to Cup. Listen, lass. Okay. There's one last piece of business we need to settle before we go after Mercer. The leadership of the guild. Carlion, thanks to your efforts. As a result, we both feel that you have the... And the Major's College? That's pretty crazy. I'm good at what I do. I've never been one to lead. Never desired it. Never cared for it. Don't want it. Well, we have a bit of an errand to run. Then it's this. Until then, we have... I've been pouring over the... Carlia and I will meet you there. Prepare yourself, lass. Let... If you would have asked me the... Look, call me... Besides, I'd rather die with some of Mercer's blood on my blade. Okay, so the that's the last bit here. I would prefer to switch back to my own armor. Uh, where are my boots? Oh, I never made dragon boots yet. Okay. So, we are heading out of here. But yeah, you, you generally want to leave a little bit of stamina so that you don't... Um, I think you might run a little bit slower when you're out of breath. So keeping a, a last bit of stamina, I think, prevents you from a, a bit of slowdown. I might be wrong on that. But yeah, this is a fun series of uh, quests, and I really enjoyed the last bit here. So, we're headed to Urgathand, which is, uh, I guess, a little bit west of this uh, great lift that we uh, discovered earlier. So this does look like a, a reasonably versatile uh, type of uh, robot. The pinchers would be good for manipulating uh, other types of machinery. Could probably carry stuff, and the spider legs would... So how many? One, two, three, six legs. That would be pretty versatile. Yeah, so we are heading west, which is just about straight ahead. And our horse, I think that's the horse that has been following us around for a while. It seems to appear whenever we uh, fast travel somewhere. I hope I'm not making a mistake by heading down the hill a little bit. Although I probably would be happier if we could find a way to dismiss the horse because I don't want it to um, be killed by a dragon or anything like that. Okay, so further west, there's another ruin that's uh, directly south of me, but that's probably not where we want to be. Okay, almost here. It's probably this place up ahead. Oh, well, except there are bandits here, I think. ourselves a bound bell. Who's there? Let's see if I yeah. Sweet. Did not fall down. And I am not sure whether they're already inside or not. Oh yeah, they're waiting for me within. That is a sign that they are inside. So, I will keep on climbing. So this is one of those weird places in the game where 
you can't actually where's where's the entrance? and shield. So I wonder if the bandits are actually meant to have uh, stepped inside. Nice. Are meant to, uh, to be exploring the inside of these places. Because otherwise it would be a kind of a weird place to hang out. Oh, well, that's kind of nice. Fortunately, that marks me as being pretty full. Well, it works for me. If you can manage to get me, then more power to you. But I'm not seeing the stabity actually happening. But yeah, that last um, last bridge up into this place doesn't exist unless you've already started this quest. Huh, where is Carlia? Oh, so they have already went reasonably far ahead. They have killed some lockpicks. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, they've killed some bandits on the way in. But yeah, by this point in the game, as I've mentioned, I do not feel obliged to pick up everything that I could. That does sound like there's probably a machine running at me from behind, but I'm not gonna... Ooh, maybe there's not now more than one machine trying to get me. And I'm not really being damaged enough by these guys to worry too much. probably stop and uh, and fight them, but there's not a lot of reason to. Yeah, I don't really need that. And this is, I believe, where we want to be. Now, it would have been nice if the game had some uh, some video for the elevator stuff, if there were at least some animation, but I guess they, they just treat the, uh, the lever as being like a door. If you activate it, then you're immediately put on the other side. Oh, so these guys didn't do it. Okay, so yes. Where is Mercer? Have you ever seen any? 
It is a little bit irritating how many times he uses the word lass. But whatever. Lots of Falmar to uh really do not like those spinny things. Yeah, you know, can keep on summoning uh Sure, where my uh, allies went there. And it looks like the Falmer were dumb enough to step into the uh, paths of the spinny blade walls, which is pretty nice. It saves me a little bit of pain. Okay, so how can I get? up to, uh, how can I open this door? I think that's probably what I meant to do. Okay. Maybe up here? Hmm. I have to confess that it is a little bit hard to pass by treasure chests, even this late in the game when there's not a lot that I uh, hope to get from them. Oh, that's not what I want. I want candlelight. Okay, so... So apparently there's just some places on the floor that activate the uh, spinny blades. Where am I going? Aha, uh -huh. this looks like a lever and a chest. And the, is that going to open up the... Uh, the thing down there? Oh, that's what it is. So I need to pull this, and then there's another one elsewhere that needs to be pulled. That, uh, and both of them need to be active at the same time in order to open that door. Which is kind of irritating, but it's workable. Where is the other one? Somewhere around here. Ah, it is here. Uh, except I wasn't fast enough and I need to pull that one again. Now if you don't want to run then you can uh, use the slow time shout. Okay, one and two. Are both of them active now? Is there something I need to do with this, too? Oh, come on. This figures I would have trouble with the door. A little bit more. Good.
and that seemed to open it up. Let's head on through. Might avoid the uh, the blade trap. Yeah, there are quite a lot of foes in this room. Ouch. Not sure what's hitting me. Summon more Frost Atronox. Again, we're trying to level uh, level uh, summoning enough that we'll be able to conjure Dramora Lords, which are quite nice, but I'm not making very quick progress on that, unfortunately. I uh, can't quite manage one of these. Ow, that is a painful arrow injury. But yeah, these guys do quite good damage at this point, so... Yeah, Daedric arrows, that's why. Brynjolf is pretty badly injured. Ouch. And there is who we're facing right now. Thalmor Warmonger. Yeah, so that, that's a pretty well-leveled uh, uh, Thalmor. Oh, shoot. Uh, Where is it? Right, yeah, that is some pretty good damage that he's uh, he's doing to me. Uh, there is the factor that the closer you are to a foe, the more their um, the more their uh, arrows do, and the more your arrows do, for that matter. So if you really okay, bound sword. Let's that's not a bound sword, but it'll do. 
Yeah, Daedra Karos. Really nice weapon. Okay, we want to brighten the place up again, again. And I guess we want to be up there. And there are more Falmer up ahead. Atronox to summon. Let's bring a shield and a sword. This is actually probably one of the longer battles in the game that I've uh, I've been in, but that kind of comes from uh, that kind of comes from uh, this level of uh, this level of leveling, I, sh I suppose I could say. Filled chests. Crime is one thing. The last seems to. I've learned to trust her lead at this point. A few years. The thief had broken into a nobleman. I. When Gallus took. Didn't take long for Enther. Not just. Oh, Gallus and. There were just too many obstacles blocking the way. Okay, well, that's Crimes fine. Michelle, the rest. So, where are we going? We are going. Oh, we're ahead and slightly to the left, which I guess is this way. What was that? But yeah, these definitely look like more Thalmer, probably more leveled Thalmer. <gasps> But I'm still taking pretty good amount of damage here. But now I'm facing multiple at once, which is not good. Yeah, this is not turning out that well. So we're going to yeah. So really exciting combat, actually. Um, okay, that's one fewer, but I'm still facing a lot of these at the same time. Frost Atronach. Wait, why am I ducking? It shouldn't be ducking. Okay, let's back off and heal. And, uh, heal back. Take advantage of the opportunity to finish this guy off. Okay. It's another Thalmer dead. And there's one right up here. Sweet. Yeah, probably. Okay, cool. And my Flame Atronach actually is still doing alright. So that is great. 
Okay, so we need to light up the place a little bit, and uh, I'm going to keep the... Oh, there's another one up there. Oh, son of a dagnabbit. But maybe I can finish him off with the bow from down here. Let's see. What was that? Okay, not too bad. Not shabby at all. I'm at least doing them a good bit of damage before I'll have to meet them personally. Unfortunately, my allies are also good with bows. So, let's uh, keep moving. Oh, that's a trap. Yeah. And those look like some rather large spiders. It, we can easily deal with that. And I'm not sure if that guy is still alive or if he just fell in a weird position. Well. I think he's dead now. How many of these guys are there? Okay, so I need to make my way up there somehow. And I'm not really seeing how. Um, Maybe, I don't think I can make my way up here. So these these have fallen. That's definitely the case. Maybe up here. And how can I get further up? Okay, it's not gonna be over here. It's not gonna be over here. I guess maybe up here. That's looking kind of promising. Uh, that door is definitely broken, as is whatever's behind it. Okay, this is looking good. Oh, uh, okay, that's intact, and this looks like a door we haven't been through. So that's looking promising. Slave and huh. Let's push on. Okay, so there's a lever here. Let's see what it does. Oh, it turns on the spinny blade wall. shield and a sword. back off because we don't want to be chopped up by it. Well, actually the elves of today are pretty nasty too. Not nearly as civilized as us Khajiit. Whatever you want to do. 
Uh, let's take them down because I want to keep working on my summoning. of these guys. Still using those nice uh, arrows. So that is one of the things, one of the areas where I should just use the shield ability that I got. Um, Enough games. Let's end this. Not even Monopoly. him some friends to play with. Whoa! Shield. Darn it. Seems like things are pretty interesting right now. I am facing a pretty fair set of uh, critters at one time, but I'm handling it okay so far. Except I am taking a fair amount of damage at this point. So after this battle seems like a pretty good time to uh, oh. to swap. No, oh, you little oh. bastard. I am about to level and I'm going to use that strate strategically to get my health back. Okay, and restoration is at 56, not at the 60 I think that I need for the faster recovery. So what else might I consider? I could improve my block again, it seems pretty reasonable. Uh, not, yeah, let's do that because Okay. And actually, hanging around in here seems like a pretty reasonable 
way to limit the number of people who can hit me at once. Okay. And... Okay, is there anyone else in here? No, but sometimes... Sometimes uh, these areas uh, glitch a little bit. Okay, looking good now. Yep, so I'm Pat Gunn, and we've been playing Skyrim, and I will see you next time.